someone asked a question how do you corrupt a hen or how do you corrupt hens to start sitting on their eggs and it is the same question how do you corrupt hens to hatch their eggs i'll answer this question according to my experience if you're new here the chicks is my name always here to see everyone is doing chickens of course i'm the world best chicken dad don't forget to subscribe like uh, to comment on our videos and also to click on the notification bell so that you don't miss out any upload guys i have four chickens uh, just as an example to answer our question yes guys we're having this one i've stayed with this hen it's now a year it lays its eggs it goes broody and it sits on its eggs those are three things this one you see here stay cool stay cool guys i have another one here this one i've stayed with it now it's one year and a half it lays its eggs uh it goes broody and at the same time it sits on its eggs this one beautiful mother queen mother come queen mother come guys this is our queen mother uh, this is the queen mother i've stayed with this one now it's two years uh, it lays its eggs uh, it goes broody but it can't sit on it its eggs even if you uh even if it goes broody yeah you try to give it eggs it just stays there one two three days and it leaves the place so this is our queen mother is here oh now there are two years i'm with it guys i'm having this one this is our cock yeah i've stayed with this one now they are only three days it is an improved cock uh, of course my intention of it being here it's not to put in uh, it's not to mate with my hands but i got it as as a gift from a friend so i decided to bring it here uh soon i'm going to see what to do with this one but my intention is not to put in my hands so these are four chickens yes i think those four chickens will help us to answer very well this question this one is asking how to corrupt a hen first and foremost i will tell you i'll be frank here we don't corrupt or we don't bribe chickens sitting on its eggs or hatching its eggs it's all about these genes because we are talking here we are talking about three things we are talking about laying we are talking about going broody and at the same time we are talking about sitting on its eggs or hatching its eggs these things are totally different uh, uh, you people uh, we always be mistaken by having a hen laying its eggs it goes broody then for us we just uh, we take it that that hen can still hatch these eggs guys these are totally different any breed of chicken can lay and it can go broody but uh, uh, few breeds of chickens that lays goes broody and at the same time they hatch these eggs so these things are totally different so to answer this question don't be deceived uh, that you can corrupt a hen to start sitting on its eggs when it lacks these abilities 
setting on its eggs or hatching its eggs it's all about ability here what we do uh we only motivate these chickens to sit on their eggs or to hatch their eggs but we don't corrupt them uh if you it happen you having those breeds of chickens that lays goes brood and at the same time hatches their eggs we only motivate these chickens whereby if it happen uh they reach that time of laying we just prepare their laying nests uh, the place uh, that place where they are going to start laying these eggs if it happen you have to you to pick these eggs you keep them uh it is okay but what we do we motivate these chickens by uh, when you pick when it lays you pick these eggs but at least try to leave there two or three eggs uh, that will motivate this chicken uh, whereby when it reaches that time to sit on there on its eggs it will just you know that my eggs are here so that's what we do here we can use these fake eggs maybe boiled eggs or unfertilized eggs to do that one as you pick this lady eggs when it reaches that time this hen goes broody then you can transfer this hen to that safe place where it will be hatching its eggs here we are talking about motivation not to corrupt even if you will motivate that hen that lacks that ability i'm telling you it will not sit on these eggs uh, it will go brood because that one is there even if these uh, commercial layers they lays they reach that uh, they reach that time where they go brood for some days then they relay again so going brood is different uh, you will be deceived by these hens as they are going brood and for you you will just you will take it that these hens are having that ability i've been showing to you these hens they are from one line they are from one mother but you finding two ah uh, two of them are laying going brood and hatching their eggs but that queen mother is laying and only going brood it can't sit on its eggs so it's all about genes it's all about ability to sit on its eggs or to hatch its eggs but not all about to corrupt we only just motivate them that's the way that's how i tried to answer that question let me hear your opinion